Hey guys, guess where I am right now? Right now, I am in Barnes and Nobles, and I am going to meet my favorite author, Rachel Renuesso, who's a dork diaries author, and also the misadventures of Max Carpenter. And I'm just so excited to come here. The book signing um, event has just ended. And now I'm trying to introduce you guys to her. So let's come over here and look who we have. We have Miss Rachel Renuesso, and also Nikki Russell. Hi, how are you doing? I'm really good. So, I have a few questions for you guys, and I'm so glad that you guys actually took your time so you could answer my questions. So, my first one is, um, so do you want to tell me more about, like, your new Max Crumley book that's coming out? Yes, I sure would. Um, Max, The Misadventures of Max Crumley, um, book three, uh, starts off with Max trapped in a dumpster. Um, he was in his school and he ended up accidentally getting trapped there after school hours so it's like almost midnight and he's in his school and he's been fighting fighting burglars that were there oh. trying to steal the school's computers so he captures them and he's like I gotta get out of here the cops are on their way and I don't want to get them to come in and see me because then I might get in trouble yeah. so he um, tries to get away and he ends up getting trapped in a dumpster that's oh at school. God. So that's how the Dork Diary, I'm mean, sorry, Max Crumley book three opens with Max yeah. trapped in the dumpster. And, and if you look right behind you, mm -hmm. there's an illustration of. Here. Right here. So that's them um, trying to get, get out, out of, of the, the dumpster. dumpster. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that book definitely sounds very interesting, and I'm so excited to read it. I just got it today, and I'm just, I'm definitely going to review it on my channel. So, for you guys who are waiting out um, for the review, don't worry, it's going to come out soon. And also, I have a question um, about, so do you want to, um, when's your new Dark Diaries book coming out? The new Dark Diaries book comes out October 22nd of 2019. So it's probably another about what, three or four months. But my um, illustrator, Nikki, mm -hmm. who's also my daughter. Yeah. She's the... I'm going to go yeah, to her and yes. talk to her right now. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so you want to... I also wanted to ask you, like, what is the Dark Diaries book about, like, the new one? So, the newest Dark Diaries book is about Nikki going on tour with her favorite music group called The Bad Boys, oh. and she takes her friends along because they're a really talented band of their own, and they won a competition, and so now they're on their way to be featured with The Bad Boys and be their opening act, and a lot of dramatic, wacky stuff goes on during their adventure because Mackenzie ends up being their social media expert oh, no. and you know she's up to no good yeah, she is it. She so this is. will be one interesting book yes. and um, I have a poster here to show you mm -hmm. what the book's going to look like oh my god I'm so excited oh, actually I have um, book, um, book 13. 13 this is a shout out to book 13 <laughs> if you like Dark Diaries this is our newest Dark Diaries book already out in stores and then our newest book um, we're still um, working on the cover so as soon as it's ready you should be able to see it on Amazon or Barnes and noble. Mm -hmm. So that's what the, this is what the cover of um, Dark Diaries book 13. 13. Yeah. Um, and it's tells from a not so happy, happy birthday. birthday. Yeah. And then this is a poster for I'll let you hold that one. Yeah. Our, Our newest, newest Max, Max Crumbly book. Max Crumbly book three, mm -hmm. Masters of Mischief. All right. That I'm just so excited right now. And um, what's your new Dark Diaries? Um, the one that's gonna come out. Mm -hmm. Like, um, what's the title of it? Um. Dork Diaries Book 14 Tales from a Not So Best Friend Forever. Oh and God. that's because Mackenzie Hollister, the mean girl, ends up being their social director and she's hanging around them, pretending to be their friend, but she's not a very good friend. Mm -hmm. so oh God. I am just so excited, guys. You don't know how excited <laughs> I am. Like, really. Uh, this is my second time meeting them. I also met um, Richard and Russell and Nikki Russell at BookCon in New York, and I hope you guys did check out that video, because I had an amazing experience meeting all my favorite authors, and now here I am again meeting them, and I'm just so excited. So, again, I, I don't know how. I like. I'm just so excited to read the new Max Crumley book. These banners just looks so interesting and also like are each of your max comedy books like in a flow 
Um, yeah, they're, they're a three book series now, but you can read them independently. Mm -hmm. I wrote them so that you can read um, books one, two, and three in order. Mm -hmm. Or if you start at two or three or whatever, they'll still make sense. Yeah. So even though they're a series, same thing with Dork Diaries, it's a series of books one through 13, but you can read them out of order. And I have a question for you. Mm -hmm. Like, besides writing, what are your hobbies? Oh, my goodness. Um, my hobbies are reading. Yeah. yeah, I enjoy reading, um, and I also like um, gardening, like flowers mm -hmm. and yeah, and that type of thing. Awesome! That yeah. sounds that sounds really nice. I mean, because you, like you said before, you um, when your two daughters went to college, you had a lot of time. So is that when you started to write your books? Exactly. Yes. And once my kids went to college, I had all this extra time because mm -hmm. I wasn't like in their business, yeah. being a 24-hour mommy to them since they're in college now. Yeah. So that's when I sat down and actually tried to mm. write my own novel. That's awesome. Yeah. And I have a question for you, Nikki. Um, so did your mom inspire you to be an illustrator, or did you just bring it up to yourself and like you had the idea to be an illustrator for Max Crumbly? My mom was definitely very supportive of my illustrating goals. In fact, when I was a little kid and first started off drawing, my drawings ended up on her walls <laughs> with, with a black magic marker. Oh, yeah. yeah, but fortunately she didn't say, stop drawing, it's getting on my nerves, you yeah. don't know how to do it right, and it ends up on my walls. She did not tell me that. She encouraged me to keep on drawing, and she even sent me to art school. So oh, I definitely yeah. give her a lot of credit for um, uh, supporting my gifts and helping mm -hmm. them to develop. Yeah, because whenever I'm reading you know, the Dork Diaries books or even the Max Crumley books, I just every single page, of course, has a picture, and I I just love it. Like your drawings are amazing. Thank you. Yeah, and do you have like an editor or someone that helps you with the drawings? Yes, I have an art director who is assigned through Simon & Schuster Publishers. Mm -hmm. She helps finalize everything for the book, and I also have an art assistant. Oh. So um, when I have a whole lot of work to do, she helps me ink the artwork, and sometimes she even imitates my style and draws it. Oh, that's, that sounds really interesting. And again, thank you so much for letting me do a video with you guys. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, oh my yeah, gosh. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. I, like I said before, I was just so excited to come here. I'm like, as soon as my parents told me, I'm like, yep, we're coming. I, it was a one hour drive from where we live. And I'm like, with my little sister, but we manage it. And it's just, I'm having a blast already. Okay. Yeah. We're glad Thank to hear you. that. Mm -hmm. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much for interviewing us. Yeah, you're welcome. You're Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, that was amazing. And I can't wait. Yeah, maybe for another event to meet them again. And guys, I'll be right back for another book review.